Most investors see two main ways in which sustainable investing can have a positive impact on the environment and society, portfolio screening and shareholder engagement. Yet, in our research, we found that some investors go beyond these two strategies and engage in what we call field building. Field building means that investors influence the fields in which companies operate. Fields are closely related to industries, but broader. They encompass not only companies, but all the stakeholders with which companies interact frequently, such as customers, the media, or other shareholders. Through these interactions, actors within fields develop assumptions, norms, and rules that shape the behavior of companies. Field building means that investors influence companies indirectly by either influencing other investors to exert pressure on companies or working toward changing the assumptions, norms, and rules that shape corporate behavior. In this video, we show two tactics through which investors can reshape the fields that surround companies. A first tactic for field building is shifting how other investors evaluate environmental and social issues by taking a public stance on these issues. By influencing other investors, an investor can change the fields in which companies operate and expose companies to more pressure for corporate sustainability. The Dutch shareholder, Follow This, has used this tactic very successfully. Follow This submits shareholder proposals on behalf of over 10,000 individuals who own shares of oil and gas companies. While Follow This has neither the assets under management nor the elite status to be taken very seriously by oil and gas companies themselves, their approach has successfully influenced Dutch pension funds. Some pension funds followed suit after their initial refusal to support Follow This generated negative media attention, including ABP, the largest Dutch pension fund with over 500 billion euros in assets under management. A second tactic for field building is helping to establish voluntary sustainability standards. Voluntary standards include codes of conduct, certification standards, and reporting standards. Investors have played a major role in establishing such standards and have thereby reshaped the rules of the fields in which companies operate. Investors that are active in the Task Force on Nature-Related Financial Disclosures use this tactic. Many companies have little expertise on how to deal with biodiversity loss and other nature-related risks. This task force has therefore established clear standards for how companies can report and act on these issues. Such tactics change the fields in which companies operate and thereby create additional pressure for companies to become more sustainable. We explain further tactics for field building in our articles in the Harvard Business Review and the Journal of Management Studies.